The 58th United States Congress was a meeting of the legislative branch of the United States federal government, composed of the United States Senate and the United States House of Representatives. It met in Washington, D.C., from March 4, 1903, to March 4, 1905, during the third and fourth years of Theodore Roosevelt's presidency. The apportionment of seats in the House of Representatives was based on the 12th Census of the United States in 1900. Both chambers had a Republican majority. Major events <laughs> Major legislation April 28, 1904, Kincaid Act February 1, 1905, Transfer Act of 1905 <laughs> Party summary Senate Topic House of Representatives Republican R two hundred nine Majority Democratic D one hundred seventy six Silver Republican Senior one total members three hundred eighty six Topic Leadership Topic Senate President Vacant President Pro Tempore William P. Fry R Republican Conference Chairman William B. Allison R Democratic Caucus Chairman Arthur P. Gorman D Democratic Caucus Secretary Edward W. Carmack Topic <laughs> House of Representatives Speaker Joseph G Cannon R Topic <laughs> <laughs> Majority Republican leadership Majority leader Sereno E Payne Majority whip James A Tony Republican Conference Chair, William Peters Hepburn Minority Democratic leadership Minority Leader, John Sharp Williams Minority Whip, James T. Lloyd Democratic Caucus Chairman, James Hay Democratic Campaign Committee Chairman, James M. Griggs Topic Members This list is arranged by chamber, then by state. Senators are listed in order of seniority, and representatives are listed by district. Topic Senate At this time, senators were elected by the state legislatures every two years, with one third beginning new six year terms with each Congress. Preceding the names in the list below are Senate class numbers, which indicate the cycle of their election. In this Congress, Class I meant their term ended with this Congress, requiring re election in 1904, Class II meant their term began in the last Congress, requiring re election in 1906, and Class III meant their term began in this Congress, requiring re election in 1908. Skip to House of Representatives, below. House of Representatives The names of members of the House of Representatives elected statewide on the general ticket or otherwise at large, are preceded by an at large, and the names of those elected from districts, whether plural or single member, are preceded by their district numbers. Many of the congressional district numbers are linked to articles describing the district itself. Since the boundaries of the districts have changed often and substantially, the linked article may only describe the district as it exists today, and not as it was at the time of this Congress. <laughs> <laughs> changes in membership 
The count below reflects changes from the beginning of the first session of this Congress. Senate Replacements, three Democratic, no net change Republican, no net change Deaths, three Resignations, one Vacancy, zero Total seats with changes, four House of Representatives Replacements, 14 Democratic, two-seat loss Republican, two-seat gain Deaths, eight Resignations, seven Contested elections, one Total seats with changes, 18 Committees <inaudible> 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 Lists of committees and their party leaders, for members House and Senate of the committees and their assignments, go into the official congressional directory at the bottom of the article and click on the link seven links. .In the directory after the pages of Terms of Service, you will see the committees of the Senate, House standing with subcommittees, select and special and joint and after the committee pages, you will see the House, Senate committee assignments in the directory, on the committees section of the House and Senate in the official congressional directory, the committee's members on the first row on the left side shows the chairman of the committee and on the right side shows the ranking member of the committee. <inaudible> Senate Additional accommodations for the Library of Congress select Agriculture and Forestry Appropriations Audit and control the contingent expenses of the Senate Canadian Relations Census Civil Service and Retrenchment Claims Coast and Insular Survey Commerce Corporations organized in the District of Columbia Cuban Relations Distributing Public Revenue among the States select District of Columbia Education and Labor Engrossed Bills Enrolled Bills Establish a University in the United States select Examine the several branches in the civil service Expenditures in executive departments Finance Fisheries Foreign relations Five civilized tribes of Indians select Forest reservations and the protection of game Geological survey Immigration Immigration and naturalization Impeachment of Charles H. Swain select Indian Affairs Industrial Expositions Interoceanic Canals Interstate Commerce Irrigation and Reclamation Judiciary Library Manufactures Military Affairs Mines and Mining Mississippi River and its Tributaries select National Banks select Naval Affairs Pacific Islands and Puerto Rico Pacific Railroads Patents Pensions Philippines Post Office and Post Roads Potomac River Front Select Printing Private Land Claims Privileges and Elections Public Buildings and Grounds Public Health and National Quarantine Public Lands Railroads Revision of the Laws Revolutionary Claims Rules Standards, Weights and Measures Select Tariff Regulation Select Territories Transportation and Sale of Meat Products Select Transportation Routes to the Seaboard Ventilation and Acoustics Select Whole Woman Suffrage Select Topic House of Representatives Accounts Agriculture Alcoholic liquor traffic Appropriations Banking and currency Census Claims Coinage, weights and measures Disposition of executive papers District of Columbia Education 
Election of the President, Vice President and Representatives in Congress Elections Enrolled bills Expenditures in the Agriculture Department Expenditures in the Interior Department Expenditures in the Justice Department Expenditures in the Navy Department Expenditures in the Post Office Department Expenditures in the State Department Expenditures in the Treasury Department Expenditures in the War Department Expenditures on Public Buildings Foreign Affairs Immigration and Naturalization Indian Affairs Industrial Arts and Expositions Insular Affairs Interstate and Foreign Commerce Invalid Pensions Irrigation of Arid Lands Labor Levies and Improvements of the Mississippi River Manufactures Merchant Marine and Fisheries Mileage Military Affairs Militia Mines and Mining Naval Affairs Pacific Railroads Patents Pensions Post Office and Post Roads Public Buildings and Grounds Public Lands Railways and Canals Reform in the Civil Service Revision of Laws Rivers and Harbors Rules Standards of Official Conduct Territories Ventilation and Acoustics War Claims Ways and Means Whole Topic. Joint Committees Conditions of Indian Tribes Special Disposition of Useless Executive Papers Topic Caucuses Democratic House Democratic Senate Topic Employees Architect of the Capitol, Elliot Woods, appointed February 19, 1902 Librarian of Congress, Herbert Putnam Public Printer of the United States, Frank W. Palmer <laughs> Senate Secretary, Charles G. Bennett of New York, elected February 1, 1900 Sergeant-at-Arms, Daniel M. Ransdell of Indiana, elected February 1, 1900 Chaplain F.J. Prettyman, Methodist, elected December 2, 1902 Edward E. Hale, Unitarian, elected December 14, 1903 House of Representatives Clerk, Alexander McDowell of Pennsylvania, elected November 9, 1903 Sergeant-at-Arms, Henry Casson of Wisconsin, elected November 9, 1903 Doorkeeper, Frank B. Leone of New York, elected November 9, 1903 Postmaster, Joseph C. McElroy of Ohio, elected November 9, 1903 Reading Clerks, Data Unknown, Missing Clerk at the Speaker's Table, Asher C. Hines Chaplain, Henry N. Coden, Universalist, elected November 9, 1903 See also United States elections, 1902 elections leading to this Congress United States Senate elections, 1902 United States House of Representatives elections, 1902 United States elections, 1904 elections during this Congress, leading to the next Congress United States presidential election, 1904 United States Senate elections, 1904 United States House of Representatives elections, 1904